What's up guys, it's Jeremy from JayZ and today we had a huge rip of 2019 Tops Update Series. Um, uh, it was my first Holly Box opening. Um, I was, it was very, very good. Um, sadly, the video recording cut out right before it was going to end and somehow it didn't save, um, which is a bummer, but I can still do the recap. Um, it, we got some really great stuff, um, beat pretty big odds on on uh, the hit, on um, some inserts, some short prints. So let's just go through. Um, we got, geez, we got a ton of base. I'll just, I'll just show you, the, I'll move base pile. Um, just a minute, I mean, it's so big, it's like I can barely, I don't want everything to fall over. We got this much base. So, uh, I mean, there are a couple of inserts in there, but basically that's all base cards. Um, you know, when you buy a hobby box, you're, or, or usually when you buy a hobby box, you're getting mostly base. Um, but uh, I got a ton of rookies, which is which is really good. Um, so we got all those uh, uh, base cards. Then we got, let me just straighten this pile out. I'm going to put, I have to spend like an hour putting all these cards away. We got so many cards. We got like almost 300, something like that. Um, got, uh, this many rookie cards, um, I'll just go through the rookie cards for you guys, we got, I don't know, I, most of these aren't really notable, um, I think we did get, I'm just gonna go through really quickly, we got, uh, a couple of insert rookies, um, these are just the non-sleeve cards, I got a ton of sleeve ones, two, we got a Luis Arez rookie card, Rainbow Foil, we got, um, uh, let's see here, Mitch Keller rookie card, I think we got a couple of these, he's pretty good, um, we got a, uh, we have a bunch of these combo rookie cards, which are really pretty bad, because I don't think anyone really on them is very good, like this Parker, Markel, and David McKay, we probably got five or ten of those, um, just trying to look through anything that I should show you guys, we got a Tiaro Estrada, 35th anniversary, or 30, yeah, 35th anniversary is pretty good, we got a Kikuchi RD, um, Put that there. Put that with those maybe sleeve cards. There, they are pretty good, I guess. This is one of my favorite rookie cards. We got the Jason Martin gold parallel rookie card. That's pretty good. Um, number out of twenty nineteen. Um, so yeah, that was basically it for uh, for the notable rookies. We just got a ton more. Uh, um, <coughs> they're all they're all good um, because you know that you never know how good they're gonna be. Um, then we got uh, we had the silver pack. Um, so this was actually a very, very good silver pack. I'm very happy. I got some really cool cards from my PC. The, the first card that we got was a Raphael Devers silver pack card. He's my second favorite player. Um, Xander Bocas is the first. Uh, he's, um, just a really all, good all-around player. I knew he was a star from the minute they stepped on the field. He just didn't really perform so great until this year, and he really broke out. I have his autograph. Um, so really nice silver pack card of Raphael Devers. I really, really like that one. Um. I'll probably end up sleeving it. Um, we got a Griffin Canning rookie card. Um, you know, it's a rookie card. It's not very good, I don't I mean, it's not great, I don't think. But, again, a silver pack rookie card is nothing too shabby. Then these last two rookie cards were really great. Um, we got a Carter Kieboom rookie card. Um, a silver pack rookie card. Probably going to have to put this in a top loader. That is a really, really awesome card. Um, so very happy about that Kieboom. Um, and then... My favorite card from the whole bat from the whole um, uh, silver pack was the Michael Chavis um, silver pack rookie card. Got a bunch of Chavis. Got his rookie card, his rookie debut, and his silver pack rookie card. Um, so really nice Chavis and Kiebu and the Devers and Canning. So a really nice overall showing from the silver pack. And then there's also some like promotion and and looks like. You receive free Chrome cards with your purchase of twenty nine. It's like something about this, and then um, they have Tops Holiday. If you purchase twenty dollars or more of uh, Tops, you get a holiday pack. I don't know. I don't know. Is it just like normal Tops holiday packs? Because I mean, you could just drive to Walmart and see if they have a pack and and get a whole box for twenty. I don't know, but. Um, Maybe I'll try that. Uh, I think I think this is this might be what twenty if twenty twenty tops looks like. Um, if it is, not really happy about that. Um, don't think it looks very nice. 
But, uh, you know, I, I'm not totally sure. But then the sleeve cards, well, a couple of them didn't have sleeves because we ran out of sleeves so fast. But um, we had uh, Chris Paddock rookie card. Um, we had Chavis rookie debut. We had a bunch of Paddock um, normal rookie cards. That was his rookie debut. We had a Trent Thornton rookie card short print, which is pretty cool. That was my one short print, I believe. Got a Tatis um, rookie debut. We got a Kiebu rookie card. We got these were sweet. We got a Kie uh, Chris Paddock gold stamped rookie card. Um, and then, uh, well, that was that was really sick. Um, uh, these are I don't think these are numbered, but it's like kind of an insert rookie, and it's really cool. And then we got this for the banger. We got the Vladimir Guerrero Jr. rookie card in um, in the one fifty year gold parallel. So that was crazy. Uh, I don't know how much that's worth. I don't think it's worth a crazy amount because it's not a short print, but it is a really nice card right there for sure. Um, we got the Pete Alonzo, some other stuff. I'm just going to go through and say we, the notables. We got a Brennan Bustle. Um, uh, wait, Brandon Brennan. I got really confused. Um, uh, gold parallel card, um, rookie card. So that was that was pretty good. We got the Chavis normal rookie card. Um, got the Ke couple of Keston Hero rookie cards. Got a Vlad um, Homer and Derby rookie card. We that, This was stacked. We got everything that we needed to get. Um, got the Senzo rookie, Riley rookie, Pete Alonzo debut card, um, the Kevin Biggio debut. We got a, a family business of Vlad Marrero Jr. We got so much Vlad in this box. Um, we got a Vlad 35th anniversary rookie card. We got the uh, Pete Alonzo all-star game rookie card. We got the Vlad Marrero Jr. rookie debut, Eloy rookie debut, um, Will Smith rookie card, um, Mikey Estremski rookie card, which I really wanted. I only got one of those, though. Um, we got a Kevin Biggio rookie card, then we got the Kie Boom rookie debut. So overall, and then the auto, the, the auto um, this auto is pretty crazy. I, I got the pack and I just kind of saw red first. I was like, whoa, that's a red parallel. And um, I know usually red parallel autographs are um, low numbered. Not necessarily the player that I would have liked, but not horrible. I mean, I've pulled one of these autos before. I got a Matt Duffy autograph, which is not very good. Um, and so I was pretty glad to pull this guy. I've watched this guy uh, quite a few times um, in uh, just watching the Red Sox game because he was in the Red Sox division for a while. And it's a tiny bit dinged, which is kind of a bummer. But we got an Adam Jones Legacy of Baseball um, a rookie card. Um, he was on the Orioles. And he was in the AL East with the Red Sox. Um, so really nice uh, legacy of baseball red parallel autograph, autograph. It is numbered four out of twenty five. Um, so really nice one there. He's a very solid player. It's it is a little a little bit dinged um, right there on the corner, and I think the, uh, the sides are a little bit dinged, but not a huge deal. A really really nice Adam Jones. Um, so overall, I think we probably got. Pretty good value overall. We got a t just a ton of rookie cards um, with update. You never know. I mean, a rookie card you pull could be worth like trout. No one was expecting a trout rookie card to be worth like over one hundred fifty dollars like it is now, um, especially with him winning his third MVP. But um, I mean, you never you ne you never really know with update. You c I could have just pulled like the next Ted Williams's rookie card, but um, a really really sick whole box very happy for my first uh whole box rip um uh thank you guys for watching um i wish you could have seen it live i wish you could have seen the whole video me ripping it but it was an hour so i think uh like a 10 minute up uh recap is is pretty good so uh yep yeah, thank you guys for watching and i'll see you later bye